You like that? Let him Friggin', know. I almost shed Let a tear, bruh. I almost shed a tear. Let him know how you're <laughs> feeling. All right, guys. So today, we're going to find out if I'm a gold digger or not. What do you think? I, I've always had my suspicions. but you know. Really? Could Why you, would I be with you Because I got big racks. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? All right, my, guys. For my racks. He's confused. Anyways. For my racks. But before we he's find for out. Before we find out if I'm a gold digger or not. Uh, we're gonna show that? you. Can you stop interrupting? Sorry, me? it's just Lulu time. Look at Lulu. She's freaking cute. Oh my god. Cute okay, well, it's Jessica time now. Oh. Alright, guys. So, what's gonna happen is you're gonna go on your phone. Yeah. So, get your phone. Um, well, let's, uh. Right there. Oh, look what I found. And guys. then you're gonna look up the gold digger test. Hey, and then Siri. you're gonna ask me some questions, and I'm Can gonna you answer Google them. the gold digger quest? <laughs> You said. All right, Come. we'll take two tests just to be sure. I'm kind of nervous. What are you gonna do if I am a gold digger? That's it. That's Th it. This test right here is gonna. We're gonna take two just to make sure. What do you mean? There's Go like ahead. 15 questions. All right, so but we're gonna take two. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Do you ahead. love your partner? Yes. A for the expensive gifts he gives you, or B for the love and care he shows you. For the love and care that he shows me. This is this is already looking sideways. <laughs> When meeting a prospective partner for the first time, do you ask questions to gauge his financial worth? No, never. I've never really cared about that. When your partner proposes a vacation, you think of a romantic, a romantic weekend in Paris, a weekend getaway where two of you can spend time together. A romantic getaway where we can just spend time together. We can't really afford to go to Paris right now, so... <laughs> She's just flexing for the I'm team. really not. I'm really not. I'm being honest. I'm When be your honest. partner proposes a dinner date, you suggest the swankiest restaurant in town, a restaurant which serves great food. I like good food. He is the one that always wants to go to these crazy ass the swankiest. places. swankiest. Yeah, he's the, swanky. The swanky. You're yeah. swanky. Wow. You swanky. Ooh, I just popped a pimple in my head. Ew. Sorry. Ew, my, when you put that on our headboard, stop! If your partner suddenly goes bankrupt, would you dump him? Well, well, you see, money is. If important. I'm going, if no, I'm going not. bankrupt, if he's going bankrupt, that means I'm going bankrupt. And if we leave each other, then we're both, you know, gonna be broke. As your anniversary approaches, do you drop hints of the expensive things you have been eyeing? Uh, Jeffrey Star Palette. <laughs> it's a new Shane Dawson. We're gonna confused. put this. Anyways, I mean, they're not always expensive. Yes. They're not. No, no. $55 is not expensive. You expect your partner to pick up all your bills? No. No. You would settle down in life with a well-to-do person who loves and cares for you, a millionaire with lots of money, but little time for you. If I could do this all over again. <laughs> the millionaire. No. No, absolutely not. I get lonely, bro. I'd be sad. All right, do another one. One more. Just, you know, just to be sure for your sake. Your friends set you up for a blind date. What is the first thing you ask him? Is he cute? Is he rich? He's paying for dinner, right? Are you sure he's single? Does he have an accent? My first thing would probably say, are you sure he's single? Does he have an accent? I mean, it depends. No, first thing would be, is he single? And two, is he paying for dinner? Because I'm most likely broke, so I'd rather have him pay. Your boss's son asks you out on a date. He's rich, not exactly your type. Are you gonna go out with him? It's a free meal. An old guy you've known for a long time pr proposes to you, he is rich, but you don't love him. Do you accept? No, absolutely not. Ew. I cannot see myself with like an older guy doing the thing. Imagine doing the thing. Your best friend's brother likes you and, he, and you think he's perfect for you, but he isn't rich at all. He's below middle class. Would you go out with him? Yeah, I would. If a guy you're dating used to be rich and became poor, would you say, yes, money should determine the relationship work We'll work together, or we'll work through it together. Poor as in broke, can I still go to the salon and get my hair done in a mani-pedi? Hell no, I'm packing my bags right now. The money, the money doesn't matter. If I love him, I won't leave. He better get a job because I'm not gonna break my nails. Yeah, we're gonna definitely work through it together. I'll pick up another job or something. What is the best gift a guy can get you for your birthday? 
Let me read this because you're giving me anxiety of how so I'm reading. Anything that comes from the heart, something cute like a necklace or something, I don't know, I'm not picky. Let me take a look at my list, a long list that goes onto the floor. It can't be cheap, it needs to be real gold, real silver if it's jewelry. Get me some perfume, not the cheap, not the cheap kind. Ooh, in a car like a Lamborghini or R. Stop, you're messing me up. Or Audi or Range Rover, maybe a dog or some Prada band bags. Girl, the list goes on. Well. <laughs> they didn't understand anything you said. Whatever. Basically, a <laughs> bunch of expensive things. Uh, honestly, I'm happy with just a cute little love letter that I've been asking him to write me for about three years. Hi. Hi. Congratulations, you are not a gold digger. I am not a gold digger! You are the type of person who believes love should be based on money. It's about how they treat you and make you feel. You're a kind, sweet, nice person. You're not picky, but you do have standards. That's a great quality to have, too. If the guy happens to not be rich, that's just a bonus. Oh, if he just happens to be rich, wah, wah, wah. Basically, you have a realistic outlook on life. That's if it's wrong, right. just ignore it. It's just a quiz for fun. Aww, how sweet. So, so clearly, clearly, I am not, not a gold, gold digger. digger. The, the test says it all. Yeah. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for finding out if I am a gold digger or not. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. subscribe. Join the family. It's super easy. All you have to do is hit the little subscribe button and then hit the little, little notification, notification button, button to know to whenever we, we post. We hope you have an amazing day. day. And we, we love, love you. you. Bye, Boogles.